All right. Um, a couple of weeks ago, we looked at a mechanical calculator, and today we have a clock works. Um, my colleague here uh, has a evening hobby of building clocks, and he knew my interest in mechanical machines. Oh, there we're going to get a chance right as we're speaking to to watch, and we missed it almost, but. What we're seeing in the back there is the is the chime mechanism. Um, all the all the hammers and uh, the tune wheel. I'm not sure that's the right word for it. You see in the back that has nothing to do with the chime. It's totally the uh, the chime. Um, obviously, watch. We're hearing a tick here. Um, in the back, you can see the very short. It's going too fast because there's not a pendulum hanging on it. Um, pretty much in the back here, what we have is the chime mechanism. doesn't really help with time. If we look down in here, those gears are not all of them, but largely related to time. And then on the bottom, we see that large brass thing with big gear. Um, that is the spring. And if we go in the front here, you see a lot of stuff going on. Um, but this is, once again, pretty much related to chimes. Um, you can see the hour, the hour gear here. Um, of course, the wind up, uh, wind up, what should we call that a key? There's three of them. I think the one is for the time, one is for the one type of chime, and the other chime. Um, here you notice is a lever, and what this lever does uh, is it, it decides what tune gets played. It just there's three different tunes, uh, three different places, and it moves it back and forth. There you see it going. There, the, it's playing uh, 